Lowe, and I'm a social worker from YMCA. I'm very happy and glad to talk to you, all you uh, uh, policymakers and uh, uh, politics, and uh, convincing you to uh, legalize same-sex marriage. And I will start off by uh, convincing you by positive appeal. So, the first positive appeal I would like to mention is if we legalize uh, same-sex marriage, we are creating a new revolution, uh, revolutionary social norms. Um, we can signal to the society saying homosexuality is not your little weird thinking. It's not abnormal to have this kind of thoughts. Um, gay couples can be approved and recognized by the society. And definitely this is a, a great social, cultural and advancement in our society. A second positive pill is reducing conflicts in our society. Legalizing uh, same-sex marriage can, end, can put an end to deprivation of rights of gay people. We're giving them rights as um, marriages, benefits. Also, we are eliminating an uh, uh, inappropriate dispute to those gay sex, uh, gay couple and homosexuality. Like, we can see, uh, we can put it into violence toward uh, gay couples and harassment. The third positive appeal I would like to point out is we are preventing the population displacement. The, uh, the current situation is if I want to uh, get married and I'm gay, I will, ha I will have to move to another state like California or New York to uh, complete my marriage. This is a very big concern to households and would create uncertainty no matter uh, on a familial stance or a governmental stance. But if we legalize same-sex marriage, we can, not only we can get gay couples to live happily, but in a governmental stance, we can keep, uh, the, uh, we can prevent the drastic change of population to the, um, uh, to the states and would have a great effect, would not have a great effect to the daily operation. So I hope all you uh, policymakers, after listening to my points, I would like you to vote for uh, the legalization of gay, uh, gay marriage. Thanks.